Welcome to Fantastic Vision. Please subscribe us before you watch today's video. As the foundation of informatization and digitalization, chips play a vital role in today's technology industry. Whether it is the internet, mobile internet, artificial intelligence and other fields, chips are the core of technological development. Therefore, with the continuous development of technology, the importance of chips has become more and more prominent. In recent years, a smokeless war has been launched around the world around the chip industry. As a global technological power, the United States has always monopolized the chip field and does not allow any country or region to challenge its hegemony. Once potential competitors are discovered, the United States will take suppressive actions. In the past, Japan was very powerful in the chip field. However, after the United States found out, it took a series of measures to defeat it. Nowadays, China's chip industry is booming, and the United States has begun to feel worried and is trying to suppress China through various means. Especially in terms of chip manufacturing technology, the United States, together with Japan and the Netherlands, is trying to contain the progress of China's chip technology. However, under the current situation, despite the United States' efforts to suppress it, it has not been able to stop China's development. In particular, the advent of Huawei's Karin 9000S chip is a direct blow to the United States. After reverse scanning and analyzing the chip, the American media bluntly stated that China's chip manufacturing technology has caught up with the United States, and the gap with TSMC is only about two generations of technology. According to Tech Insights analysis, the transistor density of the Karin 9000S chip is equivalent to TSMC and Samsung's 7 nanometers process. The chip manufacturing technology, currently mastered by the United States, is limited to 7 nanometers. Therefore, the American media believes that China's chip technology has caught up with the United States. However, Compared with the world's most advanced 3 nanometers, international media believe that China's chip technology is still far behind the most advanced level, roughly within the range of 2 to 2.5 nodes. After all, there is only a 5 nanometers gap from 7 nanometers to 3 nanometers. However, China cannot be too optimistic too early. Although China has made a breakthrough in chip manufacturing technology, reaching the 7 nanometers process, the chip technology itself is affected by many aspects, such as EDA, electronic design automation, IP, intellectual property, design, manufacturing, packaging and testing, semiconductor equipment and semiconductor materials, etc. In these areas, the United States has strong capabilities in EDA, IP, design, semiconductor equipment, and semiconductor materials. Therefore, China still needs to work hard in many aspects and cannot be complacent just because of this small breakthrough. China needs to keep a low profile, stay dormant, and fully catch up with or even surpass the United States before it can have the capital to make high-profile propaganda. As the foundation of informatization and digitization, chips play a vital role in the modern technology industry. The technologies relied on in the internet, mobile internet, artificial intelligence and other fields are all based on chips. As technology continues to advance, the demand for chips will also increase. It not only determines the performance of the equipment, but also plays a decisive role in the development of the entire industry chain. To better understand the importance of the chip, China can compare it to the human brain. Just like China's brain controls China's physical movements and intellectual activities, the chip also realizes the functions of the device through the transmission 
and processing of electrical signals. It is the bridge connecting hardware and software, and is also the key to data storage and processing. Due to the importance of chips, countries around the world have invested in competition in the chip industry. The United States has always been the leader in the global chip industry, with strong technological strength and market share. However, with the rise and development of China's chip industry, the United States faces challenges from emerging competitors. With its strong technological advantages and mastery of core technologies, the United States has always exercised strict control over chip technology. Especially in high-end process technology, the United States has always been in a leading position and has tried to restrict the development of other countries through various means. In the past, the United States has suppressed Japan's chip industry and successfully brought it down. Today, China has become another challenger, and its rapidly developing chip technology has put tremendous pressure on the United States. However, the chip war is not just a technological competition, but also involves multiple levels such as politics, economy and security. Countries are trying to strengthen their position in the chip industry through independent research and development and mastering core technologies. Therefore, the chip war is also a war without gunpowder, but for the country concerned, victory is crucial. China's chip industry has achieved amazing development in the past few years. As one of the world's largest manufacturing countries, China has been committed to developing its own chip technology. By investing heavily in resources, China has made major breakthroughs in chip manufacturing technology. Among them, the advent of Huawei's Kirin 9000S chip is a milestone event. The chip uses a 7 nanometers process, and the transistor density is equivalent to the same level of processes from TSMC and Samsung. After reverse scanning analysis, American media stated that China's chip manufacturing technology has reached or even surpassed that of the United States. Although China has caught up with the United States in manufacturing technology, there are still gaps in other aspects. The United States still has an absolute advantage in EDA, IP, design, semiconductor equipment and semiconductor materials. However, the rise of China's chip industry is not only reflected in manufacturing technology. The Chinese government has also formulated a series of supporting policies to encourage innovation and development. At the same time, China is also promoting the improvement of the industrial chain and the improvement of independent innovation capabilities. These efforts and investments have paved the way for the development of China's chip industry. Although China's chip industry has made major breakthroughs in manufacturing technology, there are still many areas that need work. First, China's chip industry needs to make breakthroughs in other key areas, such as EDA, IP, design and semiconductor equipment. At present, these aspects are still mainly controlled by the United States and have become a bottleneck for the development of China's chip industry. Secondly, China's chip industry needs to strengthen SML. its innovation capabilities and the protection of independent intellectual property rights. The development of chip technology requires long-term investment and continuous innovation. Only with independent intellectual property rights can we be truly invincible. In addition, strengthening cooperation with the global chip industry is also an important way for China to get out of the predicament. By sharing resources, technology and markets with other countries and regions, China can achieve comprehensive development of the chip industry faster. In addition, strengthening international cooperation can also prevent competitors 
from using trade wars and other means to suppress China. China's chip industry has made great progress in the past few years and has caught up with the United States in manufacturing technology. However, breakthroughs still need to be made in other key areas, as well as greater innovation and intellectual property protection. Only by strengthening international cooperation and jointly promoting the development of the global chip industry can China truly get out of the predicament and realize the overall rise of the chip industry. During this process, China still needs to keep a low profile and stay dormant, aiming to catch up with the United States and strive to achieve high-quality development of the chip industry.